What's up everybody? This is a, uh, it's the third week of the month. That's usually when allocation is dropped. And I'm at a, the biggest store around to check out. I heard that there might be some things laying on the shelf, so we're gonna check it out. It is also like the week before Christmas. And so there's lots of stuff that's supposed to be coming. And so I'm gonna check it out. I appreciate them letting me shoot in here. It's Wine, Beer, and Spirits. And uh, they are the best store around for me. And it's, uh, so hopefully, we find something that's worthwhile and not just a pain in my butt. Yeah, we're just checking it out to see this Bluestone Manor. It's got a real interesting bottle to it. That reminds you anything that's a little bit more allocated. It's probably what they were going for. More Castle and Key than I've ever seen. Small bash and then two different labels. That's interesting. Restoration Rye. Anyway, has anybody ever tried this? Let me know. You've tried this, and this is batch two. Old Portrero. Single barrel rye. Interesting. Blaine Bow. Got all the keys. All the smoke wagons. Malted rye is interesting. Southern Star Paragon. Several people have told me that I should try it. Should I pick that up? Here's a store pick from them. Single barrel rye. I might have to pick that up. I, I like Jack Daniels rye. Cast strength store pick, Ezra. Oil fire. That sounds like a quality. Oh, for major gross. I have to agree. The only reason that you would ever have one of these bottles in here is that your mom bought it for you for Christmas because she didn't know any better. All the Mictors. Let's go to the others. Got your Stellums. All of your Jeffersons at Ocean. These are fun toppers. Cooking stripe, bourbon finished, and pork cask. Interesting. World whiskey. Mm. All the pin hooks. The seven year one I like a lot. I haven't had the eight year. That's interesting. Go to drinker all the time. Bowman Brothers, not a bad price. All the Clyde's Maids. Have you guys tried the Clyde Maids? And the chicken one. It's more of a joke than anything. Rebel 10. Standard wild turkey. Wild turkey rye. Let's drop down. The solid $18 bottle of mellow corn. Old Crow. Should I try some Old Crow? I haven't had it for years. Rabbit hole. This is my favorite standard one. I had the cast drink for this on the live. I thought that was really good. Soldier Valley, Western Sun. This is local to the state. It's okay. Got campfire, string hands. I don't like that at all. Russell Pig 12. Bone mm. Snapper. Prime Blended Whiskey. Interesting. All the Penelope's. Yeah. I tried the Statesman. I heard some people don't like it. I think it's overrated. It's actually a good price for that because it's only about the same as everything else here. Maker's Mark. No dunkers in there. All right, we got the knobs. That's knob 12. 
all the Richters. Revelist. I actually have a bow there. I like this one a lot, but I've been looking for the eight year. Good bottle right there. All the Jeffersons that I won't buy. Down to the bottom, some boulders, Kentucky Tavern. And then bad decisions and come. Well, that's about it for whiskey, guys. Old over old. Looking for the tin. Here's all the different store picks. I picked this one up. It's delicious. I have an old elk too. I'm gonna go try this one at the bar. It's nice that they actually give you pours, you have to pay for them, but it's nice to sample before you buy. Checking out some scotch. This red breast has the uh, birdhouse with it. Let me know, guys, I don't drink scotch. What is interesting? This is Japanese whiskey, obviously. I suppose some of those were Irish whiskeys, weren't they? <laughs> it's going through quite a fast. I don't want to catch any of the other customers. The Whistler, I've been seeing that around a lot. And now we're to the actual scotches. Got the log of a Lynn. That's the one I started with. It's an interesting one to start with. I wouldn't suggest it, but it holds a special place in my heart. Blue label, hard bag. Johnny Walker's. Let me know if I need to get one of these. Interest you guys. The Dalmores. Let me know. I should pick up one of these. I've heard about the Brook Lotties. But which one? That's a, that one says heavy peated. And if you're a heavy peat fan, I suppose that's something. Just got suggested the Glen Fitted. 15. So yeah, give me some guidance, guys. What do you want? Well, I don't think I was lied to, but I am definitely disappointed. There wasn't as much stuff as I expected to be out especially right before Christmas. I thought they would have a lot of offerings and eh, it just wasn't it, but I got a Penelope Venezuela or I got a Penelope Valencia. So, I mean, that's not going home empty handed, but there was some stuff in there. Just not for me. So, you know, thanks for watching. Smash that like subscribe. Let me know if you guys got, something awesome for Christmas as Santa drop you off something, or if you got lucky in one of these uh, allocated drops until next time. Appreciate y'all.